a random haul. Um, I just went to Bath and Body Works and Sephora, Honey Drugs and Walmart. Just a random one and the only reason why I'm filming it is because literally everything was on sale. I don't really like to buy anything that's regular price. I know it sounds like a cheapskate but hey, gotta do what you gotta do, right? Literally everything again was on sale or free. Like that's just how it works with me. I never pay full price for anything. I always go for the bargains. I always go right to the clearance section just to find everything and literally I did. So yeah, so without further ado, let's just get into the video. My birthday was in February and of course I had to place an order with Sephora. Like, um, it was my birthday month so I didn't really um, buy too much from there but most of it was like I used my points as well as I got my birthday thing. But yeah, so I got my birthday my birthday gift from um, Sephora. I was really excited about that. Can't wait to use these products. I don't own anything of Tart Tart Tort. I don't own anything of Tart, so I was excited to get this for my birthday as my birthday gift from um, Sephora. So that's the whole reason why I placed this order was to get this gift. So I got the little Tart. Um, and it, oh, it doesn't come in. Oh, I just swatched it. Oh well. I didn't want to swatch it, but that actually looks really pretty. <laughs> My finger caught it. But yeah, this is what it looks like, and it's called Parte. Um, and then I got the little Tarte lip gloss, um, lip paint, whatever it is. And this one was, in, what color was it in? Birthday suit, I think it said. But the one thing I did buy, um, which was, I think it was like $36 Canadian or something like that, um, was the white chocolate chip by Too Faced. The only thing that sucks though is I thought it was going to be a little bit bigger, like I knew it was going to be small, but I didn't think it was going to be this small. But that's the whole reason why I bought it was this one. So this is what it looks like, the little chocolate bar chip. It's like the size of my hand. I thought it was going to be a lot bigger, but oh well, I love Too Faced, anything Too Faced and it smells like chocolate. And the colors are just amazing. I am so excited to use it. I can't wait. I haven't actually swatched any of them yet either. But, um, but yeah, I love Too Faced, so I got the chocolate bar palette. The only reason why I got it was to get my birthday gift. Yeah, I got this cute little eyeshadow from Sephora, which I was able to use my points for. It's just like this cute blue color. Um, I don't like I said I don't really have that many points, but I was able to use it to get the Sephora. I don't own any of Sephora's eyeshadows. I as well as I got the Beauty Blender Solid. Um, I guess it's the soap for my Beauty Blender, which again I don't own anything like that, so I picked that up with my points. I got a tester perfume, and I got that one. And I also love the Buffing Buff Two 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 Twenty of Lancome Foundation. I'm pretty sure that's gonna match me. It says buff, so it looks pretty good. So I got that as a sample. And then I also got the Tory Birch perfume as a sample. I don't know, I just threw those in there. But um, with my points too, I was able to get this cute Bobbi Brown lip color. It's in Sand, sand Wash Pink. It doesn't even look like a pink, it kinda looks like a brown, but um, I just love mini lipsticks, so I was so excited that I was able to pick that up as well as the Tarte one. I also got um, Elizabeth and James, Elizabeth and James and Navrano for her in the white uh, roll-on, I think it is. Or is it a spray? No, it's a roll-on. And for this size, I was pretty impressed, and I actually really, really like the smell of it. It actually really smells good, so I was excited that I was able to use my money to get a sample of the pretty much a full sample of it. Who is blowing something? But yeah, I was able to use my points to get the little Too Faced Sweet Peach little sample thing. And it's in the shade, what color is it in? It's in Pure Peach and it's so small and so cute. I love it so. The reason why I made the order was so I can get my birthday gift. But also too, I really wanted the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Chocolate Chip Palette. What a Too Faced Chocolate Chip Palette. Uh, these are the two things that I wanted and the bonus stuff with the extra stuff with my points and that was great. I went to Starbucks and I got this new tumbler. Um, it's just pink and with a pink lid and purple straw and just the, the medium side of the grande one. And I always love these guys. I drink my water, everything from it. Uh, I have so many of them. My son actually just broke my venti one. Um, broke the inside so now all the water goes in and underneath and I had to throw it away so I got myself a new one and it just has flowers. I don't know if you can see it, but I think it's flowers or is it scribbles? It actually might be just scribbles, but it is white line and it, I just 
I got drawings in the pink lid and the purple straw. So that's what I got from Starbucks. I thought he's going with Bath and Body Works. Um, sweet, the Velvet Sugar line is no longer sold in Canada, or at least where I am in BC. I don't know if it's all throughout Canada, but I know that they're just, they discontinued it last year. Um, so yeah, so on the sale that they had through the States, I don't know, I think I paid like $80 for all this to come up here, but it was like buy through, get, buy through, get through. Uh, hopefully she doesn't watch it. If you're watching Michelle, you ruined the surprise. <laughs> it's okay. But yeah, so I was, but yeah, so in Canada, uh, well, I can't really say in general, Canada in general, but in BC, especially where I am, it's been like, it got discontinued, Velvet Sugar and um, Vanilla Madagascar. So next, my next round of shipments is going to be Vanilla Madagascar for my mom. <laughs> but, um, <clears throat> but yeah, I was able to get the Vanilla Sugar Body Cream, which I love the smell. I have one, which is like almost gone and I was excited that I was able to pick two of those up as well as um, vanilla sugar um, shower gel which is exciting too because I love the scent as well as I was able to get the vanilla sugar um, body mist which I actually already opened one up I think it was this one and I already put it in my little refill thing but yeah I was able to get those okay. I got my hand sanitizer case um, with the with my emojis face that I love on it. it too much from um, London Drugs but again everything was like again 50% off or I can't remember what it was it was like 30% off or something like that but I was able to pick myself up uh, one of these Ash Brown um, NYX micro brow pencil because my Anastasia one it's all ran out it's all done for I was so sad and I can't afford to get another one right now so I was able to pick this guy up it was like eight bucks but it was on sale for four so I got a brow pencil from NYX. So I got the NYX contour stick. It was in the shade light medium and it was like six bucks I think it was, like eight dollars and it was like two dollars off. I can't remember what it was. I know I got it for six dollars but I can't remember what the deal was. On the shelf for like two dollars. So I got uh, the color tattoo eyeshadow in um, painted purple um, of Maybelline. I think it is Maybelline. Yes, Maybelline. Maybelline and then the purple color which I just was drawn to it. I was like, ooh, I don't know what I'll use that for, but I love the color. I also got one in the teal color, which is like this teal color blue. And again, they were like $2 each compared to like, at least where I am, it's like $8.99 to like $11.99 just for these guys. And I got it for $2. And they also had the Maybelline Dream Bouncy Blush in the color Candy Coral, number 30. Uh, again, it was like $2. I think I'd like to say it was a dollar fifty or two dollars. I don't know, but it was a really good deal. And I also got the Elf blush palette in light. Um, I was excited to see it. And again, I think it was like six dollars or seven ninety nine at London Drugs, but everything was on sale that day, so I got it only for like I think it was three dollars, which is still a good deal. But I was so excited because I don't really own any blushes like palettes or anything like that. But this is what it looks like. I thought it was amazing. It's so beautiful. I can't wait to use yeah, it. Yeah, so I was able to find it in time for $4 as well as Ender's Game. And my son and I love these movies and I was so excited that they were only $4 each. He also got Aliens in the Attic for $4. I don't know if I'll insert a picture somewhere or a video, but um, yeah, he got, so we got three movies for $4 each. So it was like 12 bucks for three movies, which we were excited about. In the clothes section, I got in a 1X in the plus size section. Um, it was on sale for $9, but when it rang up, it was only like $2, I think it was. Um, it's this cute little, it's like see-through quarterly shirt. Um, I can't really, and then it kind of has like a high-low in the back, but then it has this, uh, it has a, it has a little slit in the back. Um, but yeah, I thought it was so cute. It's in the size 1X and it was like literally like the price tag says nine, but it came out to be like $2. Cute little sweater from Walmart. Um, it's like a greeny color, pukey color, <laughs> but it was like in the size 4X. Um, so it's a little bit big on me, but I love it. And it was $15, but I got it for like eight bucks. And so that was pretty cool. Root cover up for a temporary gray concealer spray, which is pretty cool. I like the idea. It's in dark brown, but my hair is kind of like a, an over and red, so I should have got the red one, which I might go back and get the red. And then when I have done my hair brown, at least it'll match it, but I got that to try. And again, 
I think it was like eight ninety seven, but it was on. I had a coupon for it, and it was like six ninety seven or something like that. So it wasn't too expensive, but it wasn't too cheap. But still, I wanted to try and see if it worked. Got my mom this uh, all made beige foundation, and it came with uh, a concealer, which is I think it's the same or three hundred. Oh, it says medium. Um, it came in a set, and it was said it was fifteen ninety nine. It was on the clearance rack for fifteen ninety nine, but when you when she rang it in, it was only five dollars. So that was a bonus. You got a concealer and a foundation. Um, I was pretty excited about that, so I was able to get this for five bucks. And then the cool thing was that they had, um, a, they where I got that, they had a whole bunch of nail polishes, and the nail polishes didn't have any price tags on it. But when you rang it in, each one of them was like a dollar, like. I think it was like a dollar twenty-five. I'd like to say, but I know for sure I only I didn't pay more than a dollar fifty, but I'm pretty sure it was a dollar. But so I got five different nail polishes. I got this blue one from Sally Hansen. I think it is. Yeah, Sally Hansen in watercolor, five seventy, jaded, number six three one. I got from Essie. Um, what is it called? Mrs. Always Right, which I am always right. <laughs> but it's like a kind of like a pink color. I don't know. It's like a mauvey pink. I can't describe colors, but this is what it looks like. Yeah. So yeah, and I got the pink one um, in Hot Hands, as well as I got the purple one in Winning Streak. Um, very nice color. It was awesome. So I was so excited that I was able to get all five of these for like five dollars, maybe six. Can't remember exactly how much it costs, but excited to find all of them they're so nice and I love the colors and then the last item I bought I was able to find was this cute backpack like isn't it cute I love it um, it just has those two straps in the back obviously and the price it said it was on a clearance for 17 but I actually got it for like I think it was nine or ten dollars I'm not exactly sure I'm pretty sure I'll just say ten um, it was on sale for ten dollars like couldn't believe it it's such a cute little backpack it opens up and then inside it has the little zipper inside of it and it's a pretty decent size um, especially for the spring and summer and to go along with my other back my other purse that I got so I'm pretty excited that I was able to find all of these items I can't believe that I was able to score it for $10 yeah. um, so that's pretty much it don't forget if you like this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up um, subscribe if you haven't already and I look forward to seeing you in my next video bye